Hey guys, we're watching more Bluey, that little Australian show that adults like for some reason. And if you want these three adults to keep watching it, then get this video to 7,000 likes. And we watch this adult cartoon over at twitch.tv slash spilling the milk. Click the link in the description and come watch us live. Please click the subscribe button. We're trying to hit 1 trillion subscribers and with your help, we could do it this week. So click the button. It's very free and very nice. Yo, my name is Bluey, and I'm gonna do what- Oh, we can't play the opening theme in the videos anymore, because it gets copyrighted. So we need, like, to do, like, some replacement music. All right, let's do a replacement. Carrot. Yes! You got it! This is, like, oddly creative, though. Changing the colors of the top and the bottom of the markers to create different things. Like, when I was a kid, I was just like, boom, lightsaber, we're done. These kids are next level. They're making, like, tools. This is what happens when you don't let your children watch Star Wars and instead make them watch that YouTube channel. The primitive building. Oh, the, the primitive building, building videos. <laughs> That's the only entertainment they get. Hey, Bandit, what's with all the pins? Oh, um... This is how girls play. I know you would understand because you have sons and they actually play fun games like tossing the football. But I got stuck with two daughters that make me walk around my backyard playing with fucking pens. Yay, let's attack our neighbor. They're so. jumping me. Yo, editor, put the left for dead. They're jumping me audio on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think Eden has some daddy issues. I have two dads, bro. I have zero daddy issues. I have negative daddy issues. He has twice the daddy issues of the normal person. Double the dad, double the issues. Man. <laughs> Simple math. Come here. I'm gonna miss you. And then he left and never came back. <gasps> he left for the fucking milk, bro. I'll be right back. I'm just going to get a gallon of milk. A gallon. That's what we call it here. A gallon. If they put their milk in bags in Canada, what do they put them in in Australia? In, in shoes. They put them in shoes. In shoes, right? They're like shoeies. That's where it comes from. <laughs> Every time you buy milk, you also have to buy a pair of fucking Nikes. <laughs> Before moving on, this video is sponsored by Manscaped. Fellas, do you want to go from looking like this to looking uh... like this? You see, Manscaped was actually kind enough to send me their premier electric beard trimmer known as the Beard Hedger. Now, I was actually excited when Manscaped reached out and offered us this sponsor because I already use their products. Right here is the Lawnmower 4.0. This shaves my nuts. I've been messing with Manscaped for a while, so that's how you know this is legit. Look, man, first impressions are important, whether we're talking job interviews or trying to channel your inner Riz master to pull some ladies. Make sure you give good face by taking care of yourself and upgrading to the Beard Hedger plus Pro Kit by Manscaped. This is a premium beard sculpting machine with a enough power and precision to craft your style in a single sweep. Titanium coated stainless steel. Tough on hairs, but gentle on skin. I always used to nick myself while shaving, but ever since I switched to Manscaped products, well, that's been an issue of the past for me. Use the intuitive zoom wheel to choose from 20 different guard lengths. I think it's safe to say I'm a pretty big fan of the Manscaped brand, which is why I'm personally proud to say that if you use code STM20 at manscaped.com, you can get 20% off plus free shipping plus two free gifts. So please click that link in the description because at the end of the day, you're getting a great product and it also just helps the channel a lot. Thank you to Manscaped for sponsoring this video. Since she's called Bluey because she's blue, what would I be called as a black person? Black, black. Blackie! Oh God, oh, hell no, man. That would be good if they did like a children's show and it's designed to like introduce children to all the different races and then they're all named after the Blackie, race, you know? There's Whitey. like a Mexican one, they call him Beanie. <laughs> <laughs> it's all just like a cute version of a slur. The cartoon dog says to put some cardboard down underneath first. The cartoon dog! <laughs> the dog the stranger looks like us. Yeah, we can be lizards. Are they evolving? They're evolving. Bluey learns about evolution, but their parents are really <laughs> devout Christians. We don't believe in evolution, okay? Fuck Charles Darwin. They have like a poster of Charles Darwin with a red X. <laughs> like on Charles Darwin. Oh, God. The parents probably always have to go doggy style. But, um, the editor, you know what kind of track to play after that? Actually, they prefer missionary. <laughs> like we said, they're devout Christians. They only do missionary. Purely for the purpose of procreation, not pleasure. That's beautiful. <laughs> Dude, they're literally Neanderthals right now. They're, like, making, like, cave paintings. This is the evolution episode. What the fuck? Yeah, little tackers. We made them. <laughs> <laughs> How did you, you want to explain in detail what position <laughs> what did you, you do? made like, each one in? What did you do in? to make those things? <laughs> 
<laughs> they're humans now. They're humans. I mean, dogs. I mean, dogs. They're dog I mean, humans. This evolution episode, I guarantee it, is like the one that like those five Bluey fans are probably trying to theorize the entire lore and world and what planet Bluey today. Up here. Oh, oh, she's, she's going, going, to, going heaven. to heaven. She's oh going to heaven. Oh my God, it's heaven. Bluey's going to heaven. It's so beautiful. I really thought Blue was going to go to hell for all like the war crimes, but... Straight, quick, run, I actually really like the character design. I like what they did with like the fur on his face. It's a pretty interesting way of like showing age. Showing on a dog. old, you know, rapid dog. Old and he's like about to die. Yeah, the gross. Yo, can I just dog, compliment yeah. the show? Can I just compliment the show once without <laughs> you guys? Oh no, she's following us. Quick, hide. You think the grandpa's gonna die this episode? Yeah, they go in the canoe and the he has a heart attack and passes and out. He's like, I should have canoe. That was coming. That was a pun. I was trying to add another one and then it just didn't float to me. The joke didn't float to me, bro. That was good, right? That's that good, was right? canoe of you. Uh, I can't Lake from Infinity Train take this anymore, bro. I can't <laughs> gonna kill suicide myself. Are you sure you're okay, Granddad? Oh my God, he's gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna die. If he actually dies, he's gonna he's be not gonna off. fucking die, dude. They need something to do in the later seasons. He has to accept that he's getting older and needs to look after himself. Wow, look at the adult taking our lighthearted children's cartoon and making it depressing and mature now. Thanks, Mom. Chili, why can't you just let us enjoy one thing in our fucking- Oh. I still need him. This is, like, oh. really serious, to be honest. She's catching up! Cardo! Cardo! Bingo's voice actor is the best. Their delivery is yeah. so insane. Bingo's so cute. It, it's obviously, like, a child voicing it, but they, it's very authentic. I wonder why. Dude, Grandpa man spreading. Grandpa's gonna die soon, man. Let him man spread before he dies. It's his final wish. This episode of Blue is called Parcel Parcel. Parcel. It's pronounced Parcel. <laughs> Shut up. Where? In what country? What do you mean in what country? That's how you say it. Parcel. That's not how you say it. What? No. Stop. None of my parents spoke English as a first language, bro. I didn't have what you guys had. But like, had, you went okay. to school though. Yeah, because they with the, people the who spoke Parcel. English as okay. first language. Okay, okay. So I'm putting an end to the parcel discourse. The parcel discourse is important. Too long. Winner gets that. Well, what about everyone else? We'll have to suck it up. Dude, he kind of looks like Mr. Peanut Butter, bro. Be honest. The Bojack Bluey crossover arc might go crazy. <laughs> That'd be insane. Bluey joins one of the like Bojack spinoffs and has like a Sarah Lynn arc. <laughs> I don't want Bluey to have a Sarah Lynn arc. <laughs> I don't want Bluey. I don't get a present. No, because just like in real life, you. <laughs> 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 He's gonna make all these children cry. It's okay. You won five bucks. <laughs> He's just pay He's paying the kids off. Oh, yeah! Well, that was fun, wasn't it? That was a nightmare. That stressed me out so much. We play Pass the Parcel by Lucky's Dad's Rules. Oh. There's like Lucky's Dad. They're all putting it on him. <laughs> See, they're, they're learning to be able to take pleasure in other people being <laughs> They're happy. teaching them gambling! They're <laughs> fucking Australian! Okay, I like that explanation better. This is such a waste of wrapping paper. Are you- you're seriously complaining about this? The Yikes. carbon footprint of this Dude. episode must be insane. The Australian government needs to help <laughs> this, man. I thought it was just a fish for a second. That's I cute. thought it was literally just a fish. Please. Yeah, that's fine. Ooh, Ooh, what is that? That's a Japanese thing. That's like what the anime characters do. Haikyuu. Are they Haikyuu fans? Well, they are little girls, so that's 50% of the demographic. Fuck <laughs> off, bro. The other half is me. Okay, Muffy, there's the timer. Muffy. Dude, Muffy's not a good name. That's... Muff is a... Muffy... Give your sister a turn now. But I want to do a cowboy hat. This is giving me anxiety. Like, they're almost <laughs> done with the cowboy hat, bro. Let her the, fucking the finish the so cowboy hat. The, let her finish the cowboy hat. It's like everyone with OCD is losing their fucking minds watching this episode. He's coming, Muffin. <laughs> Wait, this episode is awesome! What oh the my god, the perspective the is crazy! The what the hell? so cool! Why does it look so, so good? How long is the hallway, though? How, how long is the hallway? The it's, house. it's the Shining Hotel! It goes on forever! <laughs> They're in the back rooms! I'm ending the whole facey talk. No! Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Jesus. What's going on? I'm handling it. It doesn't look like 
like you're handling it. They're having like a serious parental argument in the background right now. <laughs> it's like that clip of like them playing Osu with the parents arguing. Yeah, they're working together. That's not men. Get back here. Bro, you think there's gonna be like nudes of like the mom or something when he's scrolling through all these photos? Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Muffin is on her dad's phone. Oh no. You're gonna see Muffin's mom's muffin, bro. That's <laughs> what I wanna see. Oh my god. It's gonna end. No! 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 They destroyed the fucking phone! Well, they're fucking rich, man. They can afford a new iPhone or some shit so easily. This fairy tale's about a mean brother. Me. Bandit is such a slut. Like, look at the way he lays on the bed. <laughs> oh, daddy. Ah! Haha, made you look your daddy truck! Jinx. What? That's this is too Australian for me. Like, that sounds like a slur. And then you could never speak again. There's too much Australian slang. He said skint after too. That's like a skinhead like abbreviation, man. Like a skinhead plus c you know what I mean? Like oh that guy's <laughs> <just> skin. <laughs> that guy's such a bloody skint. What about you? Come on, speak up. He wants crumbed. Okay. Yo, dude, uh, better times. Back when they had the fucking like tables that you can eat on that were also arcade machines, bro. Those are good times. We have literally regressed as a society. Right. Jinxed him. He can't talk until someone says his name. Rad is the most Australian name. I think I think it's interesting because it, it's not just like Australian slang, but this is 80s Australian slang. Exactly. So there's like two layers of my inability to comprehend this culture. I don't know, Cord, you could pass for like a 40-year-old, realistically mm -hmm. speaking. Just smoke some more cigarettes. Cord's already deeply addicted, man. Do you really have to bring it up on stream? Yeah, I've been struggling to quit for like years. He's been struggling a lot. But yeah, no. Uh thanks, Marlboro, for sponsoring sponsoring today's video no i just helped him the only thing this 80s episode is missing is an infomercial has you or a loved one ever been jinxed before that's what we need that's how they met that's so adorable Aww, that's really sweet here you go thanks cosplay she was a hot cosplaying oh babe she was a Fucking anime fan. All right, no swearing for this episode, guys. Challenge. I can do that. No swearing, Eden. Jack, you're the one who swears the yeah, most. Yeah, you swear like... a lot too, though, but like... No, no I'll be fine. I'm not going to swear this episode. Okay. Psych! Go and clean your teeth. Aww. Come on, I'll time you. Ready, set, go! <laughs> That's not a good thing to instill in your child because you're telling them to rush through brushing their teeth, but you have to take your time. You're not a competitive teeth brusher? I'm not a competitive teeth brusher. My ELO is like mid mid as flip right now, dude. Mid as flip? Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Not flip, man. Who's catching Gekki? This is like Chekhov's Sticky Gecko, and it pulls down like 15 episodes later. It's like a climactic finale. <laughs> This is one of the Bluey episodes that just makes me stress to be a parent in the future. Like, it's the most nothing problem, but to these kids it means everything, and it just stresses you out completely. Ow! Mom. Bro, if Bluey wa started walking a little earlier, they could have kicked Bluey in the face with that. That would have been nice to see. Bluey deserves some damage. We're not going anywhere? No, we'll just stay here forever! <laughs> <laughs> All we need to do is walk out of it. Praying to the Lord, please, please, let me abort these children. Why? Because you kids don't care about being on time. Why? Chili, you are getting gaslit so hard right now. Bluey does not care what you are saying. Bluey is just saying why. But why? Just that conversation, the first answer would have been just For me because. growing up, because I said so is like the first, yeah, the first answer. You get yelled at, dude. Just like, what the hell? <laughs> gotcha. Chekhov's sticky thing. None of us cursed that episode, chat. Are you proud of us? Yeah. You that see, was really hard. Swear. That it's was even so that hard. hard. <laughs> <laughs> we should do that for the first episode, not the fucking seventh one. <laughs> yeah, that, that is what I was thinking. <laughs> This is so beautiful. That water looks so beautiful. I'm going insane. It looks a little like goopy to me, to be honest. If you change the hue of that a little bit, it would look really That weird. literally looks like a sludge. Bro, this episode is just a copy of that BoJack Horseman episode that everyone likes and I skipped because it was I couldn't take it anymore. I'm gonna leave the call. Why would you like self-report like that? Like you You didn't like the underwater episode? Yeah, I skipped it. I couldn't take it. It was so boring. I'm like, I don't wanna watch this. You're a loser, dude. Oh my okay? god. Okay, don't care. Bro, you're gonna watch the finale and say that, bro. You're gonna be like, eh, it's a little too dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> 
This is just like that Bojack Horseman. This is episode. just like that Bojack Horseman episode. That's like just like that Bojack Horseman it's like, episode. It's, it's just like the Bojack Horseman episode, except actually nothing happens. Oh, she's gonna have flashbacks to her childhood when she did this. No, she's gonna get a flashback to her childhood when the town she lived in was wiped away by a flood and hundreds oh. of people died. <laughs> and she has a traumatic PTSD attack. That would be awesome. I can't go back. I can't go back. No, Bluey. Bluey, get inside. Get inside. We have to be safe. No. Oh, oh my God. Wait, no. It's just a little more. Just a little. Ah. Come on, this water is moving really slow! Eden, you're not allowed to come while watching Bluey. That was weird, bro. I that was, was not. A sus. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. Whenever I saw Chili. You saw Chili feet. Dude, there's like a little ant like at the bottom of the water. Like. <laughs> oh. The flood is happening again, Bluey! Oh my goodness, this is just a flood. It's fucking Noah, dog Noah. And if you guys want to get on Noah's Ark, then head over to patreon.com slash spilling the milk to survive that flood. Thanks to Ace in the Hole, Alfredo Arvalo, Antric Molina, Don Fox, Rihanna Hatcher, Brooklyn Hawk, Chris Martinez, Crescent Can, Dante Pick Gamer, Detone Medic, Dead Man Flopping, Dylan, Elizabeth Travers, Fat Pup, Funny Clown, Heather Kim, Jacob Hodnett, Jixty, Joe, K99, Kate Nossett, Tomoe, Carter Reed, Killbite, Lassie Sis, Matt King Spencer, Milk2, Michael Anderson, Mr. Delta, PBNJ, Rick, Ronald Anguilla, Ryan Spies, Sam Stormer, Sean C, Suck My Me69, Swagger Bomb, Trevi Duck, Whatevers, Yo BT Ha, Angel Revaz, Atomic Leon, Evil Flavor, Black Knight, Blankazeo, Bunny Bay, Corgi, Pete, BFP, Kamal, Daniel Alvarado, Juni, Crisito, King Red G, Mark Carey, Markilla Izzle, Matthew Byers, Michael Raglan, Omega Waffles, by the way, Kumi, Are the Mercy, Rashawn Eek, Sora Key, Seller, Tide Highland, and Zabadil. Thank you so much.